What's up guys and uh, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today I've got the Dakota Packable Mallards um, with painted heads. So um, I'm going to do a comparison uh, between the Final Approach, Higden, and the uh, Tangle Free Flight Series. So I've got a uh, scale here, so we're going to go ahead and uh, open these up. Put them on the scale see what the weight difference is actually between all three of them uh, that i've got here and then see what we've got so uh, let's open her up and here we've got the drake so let's get started as far as Paint quality goes. Um, they're, I really like the detail on them. Uh, they're comparable to the size of the Tangle Free Flight Series. Um, I mean, here's the the Higden. I mean, subst substantially larger. So uh, this is just how it came right out of the box. Um, it's not plugged. They got this little port in the bottom here um, that you can blow up or expel all the air out of it. Um, but as it sits, let's go ahead and plug this up. And I guess what I would recommend doing with someone to see now is check the ports on the back of these things to make sure that they'll actually accept this before you guys just throw them out into the field and try to hunt them because uh, what I'm seeing right now is that I just had to carve it out a little bit um, before I could plug that hole. So there's a tip, I guess. All right, this thing weighs in at 19.3 ounces. And that is what I would call inflated, damn near inflated all the way. Um, the Tangle Free, looking at 31.4. This is the final approach, 14.7. and 11.7 ounces. So, the Higden is actually lighter than the Dakota Packable in terms of weight. But, you're getting damn near double the decoy. So, I guess keep that in mind. If, if weight or size is more important to you. This Higden weighs less, um, but uh, let's go ahead and see as far as like portability goes. Now, if you guys have, I, I know Lucky Duck makes some packable ones, but if you have experience with these guys, why don't you go ahead and, and, and drop a comment and let me know the good and the bad. I have not used these. Um, so, here we go. So this thing deflated. Um, yeah, I, I mean, we're 19.2. So I mean, we're, we're, and I didn't squeeze all of it out. But, um, from what I read, you can get a 12 slot bag and stuff an actual two dozen of these things in there instead of just going with it, uh, just being able to fit a dozen. Um, I heard some guys drill this out and, and get the sand out of it to make them lighter. I don't know if that's anything that anybody really wants to fuck with or, or anything like that, but I, I personally don't want to screw around with drilling holes and everything and just, leading to possible problems down the road. So, um, 
These are made out of the EVA plastic. And I just unplugged it and it inflated itself right up. So unlike that Lucky Duck turkey decoy that I had the other day, um, this thing will inflate itself right away. Um, right away. Plug it. Bam, you ready to go? No. Nope. I would imagine that even though that these Higdens are lighter, the fact that these are bigger and there's more surface area, the they would move a little bit easier with the with the wind. Um, I don't know. I, I think that the coloring on these packables is by far the the best out of you know. And these are a little bit dirty right now. I haven't cleaned them yet from last year, but. I mean, compared to the Tangle Free, I think that the head is the best uh, looking as far as the carving goes and things like that. So, uh, let me pull out a hen here for you guys to take a look at. And here's the, the hen. So this is what you guys are going to be getting in the box. And there is three hens and three drakes is how they split the box up. So, uh, yeah, if you guys uh, have any feedback on using any of these, the Lucky Ducks too, I mean, uh, I'll probably be looking to, to add some more here. I just got one dozen. I think I've only got a few dozen duck decoys just in general. Um, I've got some some Lucky Duck, uh, Lucky HD spinners that I'll do a, a demo and a review on. I, I've got two of those, so I'll uh, I'll do a review on those. I think up next, um, I've got the Boss shells, I've got the decibels, the flip tops, and then I got the Goosebusters. So if you guys got a, a preference of which video you'd like to see next, uh, go ahead and, and and let me know. Drop a comment below and let me know. Um, you can find us on our social media at Wisco Roughnecks on Facebook and Instagram. And uh, while you guys are at it, once you're done watching the video, you go ahead and subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can get uh, uh, alerted when uh, we upload. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Talk to you later.